Okay, quick update on the uh, solid state Magnavox uh, with the Magnavox changer and the spindle. I was able to find somewhat of a match online. I tried, I don't know where I left off, taking the roll pin out of here and straightening this. This, this spindle is just in horrible shape. It's, it's mashed, it's twisted. These are spring loaded and, and the action uh, may never come back. It's just, it's just too kinked up there. So I found, it came with a 45 adapter which also works, but this is supposed to be new old stock. I don't believe so. Who knows? Anyway, this is a Magnavox spindle. Pretty much identical except for one small thing. The little the little ridge here for the clip to hold it in, retainer clip. Um, what was that? There is different. That's the spring. But uh, if I eyeball, put these right up, it's exactly the same. And it does work, I'll show you. Didn't notice. That is the spring that provides the spring action on the on the uh, fatigued one or bent one, whatever you want to call it. So I'll just give you a quick demonstration here. It does it does go in the center. It stays put pretty well. I mean, I could put a, a groove in there and I suppose put that clip back in there. But for the most part, we're just going to try a record real quick uh, just to show you. I'm just going to hand walk it. Goes over, fills the record. It drops because there's no mat, so it's having trouble spinning, but okay, you get the idea. Same when it finishes. Get to the end and knows there's no record there. And it shuts off. Now, with its original 45 adapter here, I've tried it with both and they both work. Oh, this is in the back so good I can't pull it out. <laughs> is it maybe? I can't pull it out. I heard it click. Maybe you have to turn it. I get it. Oh. I heard it click. So you turn and pull it out. Okay. I'm going to get some 45s. So I'll load up. What have I got here? I've got four. I'm going to leave the overarm off because I think this is bent down a little bit. It will go over, but it's I think it's bent a little bit. So, okay, we're hand walk it again. Goes over, drops, and plays. Okay, we'll reject. Number two. We'll reject that. That's the one that doesn't fall. That's the stacks one. That one has an issue. But I'll try it again because on the other 45 adapter, that one did fall. Ooh. Shook it a little too much there. There it goes. Now it shuts off. It did drop the record though. No, it did not. I'm just going to flip them over because this stacks one seems to have the, the issue dropping. The RCA is fine. Plays. I'm going to send it to the end here. Yeah, this stacks. This stacks one doesn't doesn't has an issue. There it goes. Anyway, I'm not too 
too worried about that. So well, there you have it, and then we'll do the last one. We'll record will go over and shuts off. So I'm glad that the spindle fits and works okay, and the amplifier is next, the one channel that's out. So there you have. I will show you one thing quickly. The um, the 45 adapter that we got, it's the uh, rectangle type. I'm going to take the same stack, place it on the spindle, towards rear of changer. I don't want to press it down too, too far. Okay. I'm going to put the stacks, I'm going to invert, well, just see, I'll just, just try it. We're going to put all four on there. We'll hand cycle it. And that's one. Okay. Two. the suspension there. One last reject. And like this. Bring them over to the end. No record. And shuts off. There you have it.